Now, you may have heard that uh, Raspberry Pi have just released their latest uh, operating system. It's called uh, Raspberry Stretch. And if you head over to the download site, you can now access the new um, Raspberry Stretch desktop. So I'm going to give you a quick show how to, uh, how to do this. Uh, you obviously want to right click, download the zip and uh, download it to your computer. I've downloaded it here earlier. Uh, rather than spend 20 minutes uh, of you watching me download something. Um, now you need two pieces of software. The first one is the SD formatter or equivalent program. Um, so you've got your SD card and you're going to need to format it first to make sure there's nothing on it and that it's ready for um, the new operating system. So I'm going to place this in. Open up the SD formatter. I'm just going to check it's the correct drive because I have done this before. So G is the drive there. Okay, so let's go again. Software, SD format. Yes. Right, so it's on the drive G and J as well. So I'm going to, first of all, uh, quick format, adjust the file size, yes, press OK. And I'm going to format that now. So this is erasing all the data and reformatting it. And then I've also got this, uh, the J is gone now. So I just need to that again. What? Here we go. So now we're on G, drive G, just make sure it's the right one. Boot. Again, option is a quick format, readjust for the size. Here we go. Excellent. So now I have a blank SD card, nothing on it, and it's formatted and ready. The next piece of software I'm going to need to use is the Win32 disk imaging software. Uh, there are other um, pieces of software available that will write the OS um, of the operating system to the disk. So this is the one I use. Click yes. Now we need to select where the, the actual operating system is. So there it is on the desktop. That's the one I downloaded. Raspberry and stretch. And then make sure I'm right to the right um, drive. So here we go. Drive G is my SD card, and then we're going to write yes. So let's take a couple of minutes, depending on um, your processor speed, and uh, we'll have a look at booting up in a minute. So just into the last uh, two percent or so of writing the Raspberry Stretch image to the um, SD card. So I'm going to uh, take out the SD card, which is just formatted, and we'll uh, boot this up in the Raspberry Pi. Let's see how it looks. Okay, power's in, screen on.